What's the best parenting advice you've received? Oh, wow. Um, well, when I had my second child, I was told, when you bring the baby home from the hospital, always pick up the older one first if they're crying, which was a very nice piece of practical advice to make sure that my older one didn't feel neglected. Yeah. How's Dex feeling being outnumbered by the girls? He says that he um, always dreamed and knew that he would have some sort of a harem, but he just imagined that he would be having um, a lot more sex. <laughs> Love that. So is, is that happening? You know, it's a fair, from one of us, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Great. Are the girls ganging, ganging up on you yet? Not yet, thankfully, thankfully. But I feel like it's just around the corner where they start to um, turn on us. <laughs> <laughs> and tell me a little bit of why this charity is important to you. Um, when I had babies, I realized how lucky I was to have a support system of moms around me that knew things that I didn't and I kind of became obsessed with this idea that foster care girls, I knew that 75% of foster care girls would be pregnant by the age of 21 and I felt like as a mom who went on that learning experience I should be there for other women in my community and LA has 28,000 foster care kids, it's bigger than anywhere in the US and I was lucky enough to know some women who put this into action through Alliance of Moms and I now volunteer um, with them whenever I can. I really want my kids to see the value of community and know that if we unify and support each other, it just makes everything better. What's up guys, I'm Juliana Rancic and you're watching the Live from the Red Carpet YouTube channel. Subscribe today, then be sure to check out our other Live from the Red Carpet videos right here.